Okay, let's fly up. LexCore implanted tracking devices in all of their metahuman experiment subjects. The monitoring station is on the hospital roof. Get up there and overload the station so these people can escape. Sounds like a plan. And let me just go talk to those two guys and make sure I actually did complete their missions. Thanks. Getting rid of those inhibitors will even the odds a bit. You're very welcome. Oh, thank goodness. Who knows what the secret society was planning to do with this data? Okay, yep. Saving the day. So now let's deactivate this LexCorp signal jammer. Oh, and luckily, missed the building, but found a side mission. Do you have time to help me? LexCorp's gladiator suits are running off a highly unstable power cell. We believe it's based on stolen Star Labs research, but with a fatal flaw. Can you collect those power cells carefully? I don't know about carefully. I'm more used to just smashing everything around me, but we'll see. One gladiator down. Oh, okay. I've apparently collected six gladiator power cells. Not sure when that happened. Damn it. Almost finished hacking that thing, and then bad guys just spawned in from nowhere. Okay, let's try this again, and this time I won't be getting interrupted. Maybe. Without that monitoring station, Lex will have to track down those patients one by one. Show his troops they have more to worry about right now. Like facing us. Ooh, Soup's just said us. So me and Superman, is he gonna come in and help? some more baddies. I want to find more gladiators though. Let's see if more have spawned down here yet. Nope. Okay, I'll, I'll just hover back. Oh, there we go. Hover back and forth and now some more baddies. There we go. Hello you. Ooh, and goodbye you. You went flying. But aren't you glad I came to find you again? Okay, just a couple more gladiators to go. Western communications disrupted. Yeah, this is a very, very small area, having to go back and forth in order to make the gladiators spawn in. I think after these two, yep, one more to go. Done. All right, let's. Oh, you're hitting me from all the way over there. Do you have a gun or do you have powers? Actually, let's move back and see. Let's see what he does. Oh, well, he definitely has powers if he can move like that. Yeah, sorry, I just thought you had a baton. I didn't know you had long-ranged attacks. Well, he's done. Let's find the LexCorp assault vehicles. Wherever they are. Ah, there we go. Down on the ground. Have I completed your mission? Oh, yes, these are definitely based on confidential Star Labs work. Thanks so much for helping us retrieve this research. No problem. Okay, so now I'll get to work on destroying all these weird looking vehicles. And so I don't get too distracted by all the enemies, I'll try flying over them until I find another car.
Again, there seems to be a pretty small area and not a lot of things that I need to find are actually spawning in. So I have to fly back and forth and hope that in my absence they'll respawn in. There we go. There's one. And let's find another car. There we go. Hello, you. And you know what? Let's see if I can just sneakily fly away without even engaging those guys. Not really. Oh, he's intent on following me. Fine. At least you broke away from the others, so I don't have to deal with them. Go. Go ahead, punk. Make my day. Need to discharge this power before the soup blows. Okay, one more left. Let's see if I can find it in no time at all. Or if I'll have to hover around quite a bit before it spawns in. There we go. Nice and quick this time. Luckily. All already, damn it. There we go. Okay, job done. Damn, that that one was a little bit of a mess. Having to move back and forth, waiting for the damn things to spawn in so I could destroy them. Sorry about that. Oracle is blocking any more transmissions from Lex's unique point of view. For now, join Supergirl inside. Help the Metas and arrest whoever's in charge so they can stand trial for these crimes. Okay. Ah, there's the entrance. You know what? I'm pretty certain that... Oh, okay, that's what's going on. The camera is below me, under the floor. Yeah, I'm pretty certain this isn't supposed to be how the game plays. Uh, no, not at all. Okay, let's go back to the end exit and uh, try this again. Oh no. O okay, has that fixed it? Nope. Um... Okay, why has the camera decided to do that? Well, all right, uh, let's let's do the usual, the standard that fixes all technological problems. Turn it off and on again. Yeah, there we go. Problem solved. All right, let's head back inside, and uh, hopefully the camera won't go crazy again and decide to go underneath the floor. There we go. Nice, normal camera. That's what I need. And hello, Dr. Hope. There are people trapped in tubes inside the hospital. Metas, but still people. They're being processed in tubes so they can be used for their energy. I work for LexCorp, but I'm human too. Get those people out of those tubes. Yeah, well, you're going to be put on trial after this. Okay, so I've just got to deal with a ton of security forces that have been given maybe permanent or perhaps temporary metahuman abilities thanks to all the experiments that they're running here. I mean, hey, they must be powerful. They're as tough, if not tougher, than these giant robots or maybe mechs they've got? I don't know. 
There might be someone piloting that thing. Or... Oh yeah, of course, yeah. I've been hearing the guys complain, Ah, get me out of here before the fuel cell explodes. Each time I take them down. Hey, where are you going? You starting to run away? Well, I'm not going to allow you to do that. Oh god. Oh no, okay. That's an empty bed. For a second I thought it was a, a tarp covering a, a dead body. Like, not only are they doing horrible experiments on these people, torturing them, but yeah, there's a bunch of corpses just littering the halls as well from failed experiments. And let's see what this is. I, I think it's just a recording or something. Get out of my mind. Dr. Cisco journal entry. Meta research project. Yep. And if I move away from it... Ah, okay. Subdue hallucinating matters. There we go. You're fine. Just like before the bestiomorphs and the hypnotized Amazons and just just everything. If you come across someone who's hallucinating, punch them in the face and it will solve all of their psychological problems. What else can you find? Let's see how well you do with a little game of hide and seek. Dr. Psycho. What a creep. That's fine, I'll be able to beat you no problem. Doesn't matter if you disappear. I'll find you once again. Especially, especially if I have my body surrounded by ice and frost like this. Unless he disappears entirely. Are you still in the room? He must still be in here. Three blind minds. Three blind minds. <laughs> What a creepy guy. Okay, so now the doors have unlocked. And yeah, I thought he would be trying to beat me, not just hiding and letting me run around, not engaging him at all, but all right. Okay, let's help. And again, if you come across anything bad, what's the solution? Punch it. So if they're trapped in these huge tankers, should I find a console or something to... you? Ooh, you started sort of moonwalking out. Should I find a console to open the tankers and let them out? No, no. Just punch them and make them blow up. I'm sure that'll be safe for the people Sometimes inside. I just isn't enough of me to go around. Time to change that. How about a little more me? Ah, oh, Doctor Psycho, you weird, creepy thing. Pop goes the weasel. Okay, I'm pretty sure. It's been a real blast. The real one is somewhere here. So happy I could burst. There, you, you're the real one. So I'll focus Sorry all of my efforts on you. There she blows. Okay, he's run away once again. Let's find him. And damn Supergirl, I can't believe you got taken out by this guy. He's a chump. I mean, he's real freaky, but other than that, He's a chump. Okay, trying to free all the patients whilst fighting these guys, because they will help. There we go. Damn it, I would have thought I could just bust that down, just punch straight through it. Okay, 
let, let me in, let me in. There's too many of you now. I can't even punch the guy because he's getting in the way. Okay. There we go. So apparently that's all of the metahuman save, but obviously I can see them. There's still more of them just in these tankers here. So the game would have been fine with me just leaving those two guys captured to be experimented on in the future. And that's just another recording, so I'll ignore that. Don't want to waste any time picking up things that I can't even hear as soon as I get far enough away from them. All right. Showtime. You have no idea what it's like to be me. What gives you the right? You think you can stand in judgment over me? Time for you to walk a mile in my shoes. One day, all these heroes will be my slaves. Today, their mere image will be your death. Behave yourself. Crypto will be sad he missed this. I wonder why he's got three female heroes. <gasps> Creepy guy. And yeah, luckily these guys are nowhere near as tough as the originals. Otherwise, I'd be dead in a second. Once again, need to find the real one, and I think the real one is just in front of me. Because, you know, I'm not defeating him instantly, like all the other little hallucination mirages, or whatever you'd classify them as. And don't you try disappearing, going invisible, making me look like a fool again. Don't do that. There we go. Oh, his tiny, tiny little body. So, man, he looks like a baby right now. All right, let's arrest him. How can you resist my illusions? Well, if I know they're illusions. And what do I want? Yeah, let's take that. Why not? Okay, Supergirl, where are you? There you are. Man, how'd he get the drop on you? I handle him no problem. Uh, thank you. Dr. Psycho weakened me with kryptonite and stuck me in this red sunlight cage. I think he even took some of my blood. I have to go talk to Cal. I mean, Superman. Thanks again. Maybe we can talk when I don't feel so sick. Yeah, yeah, sure. I'm, I'm, I'm not doing anything weird. Want to see the world through my eyes? It's easy. Just picture everything you want and can't have. And multiply that ten thousand times. Everyone laughing at you, pushing you aside, unless you take the power for yourself and make them give you what you want. Luther knows, soon they'll all know, and when I get what I want, I'll be the only...